Friends, thank you for watching my channel. I just want to remind you if you need wallpaper, go to www.wallpaperboulevard.com. Tell them Spencer sent you. In fact, if you use my hashtag, Spencer Colgan is wallpaper, they'll be sure to give you a 10% off at your checkout. No matter how much you order, they have a wide selection of wallpaper. Check it out. Tell them I said hello and enjoy your discount. Hi, this is Spencer Colgan from Spencer Colgan is Wallpaper. Today, I'm going to see if we can hang a wallpaper mural in a suit. And one of the things I'm gonna to try to do is to show you how strenuous this is on me. And by the end of the video, if all goes right, this shirt should be soaked through and through. Now it's a long story why I'm in a suit. But suffice it to say that um, I had something to do prior to hanging the paper and I'm just too lazy to get into my work outfit. That's really the truth of the matter. But let's see how it goes. Years ago, there used to be a commercial on TV of some clown advertising a rolling, a paint rolling apparatus. And he was in a suit. It's so clean, you can do it in a suit. So that comes to mind. But that thing was a piece of junk. Now they sell them in box stores. It's just a roller with a, a thing under it. Classic thing. No, pro no professionals use it. Anyway, what am I doing? I am hanging a mural for a customer on a textured wall. There's, there's a mild orange peel texture and I'm rolling clear paste onto the mural. I highly recommend Dynamite 234. Highly recommend it. Or other Dynamite paste products. But I highly recommend it. It's good stuff. Super tacky. And if it's too tacky, you can, you can cut it down with water. So I wanted to discuss with you the reason why human beings sweat so much. And... Um, no, I'm just kidding. One time I had this professor, right? He's deceased now. So it was a night class and it was international relations. He was a uh, professor of political science and his, uh, his expertise was foreign relations. Anyway, this girl walks in the classroom after everybody was present. She was, a, she was about a minute late. So she walks in, I'll never forget it. But before she walked in, he says, and we'll be specifically looking at the relations between the United States and Russia. So this girl walks in and then he says, and in particular, we'll be looking at cellular migration, uh, the way cells divide meiotic cell division, mitotic cell division, and the girl goes, and she starts to walk out because she figures she's in a science class. And he goes, oh, no, 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 you can come in. You're just late, you know. <laughs> it was probably the funniest thing I ever saw that some, a practical joke. I thought it was hysterical because he switched in character. And then we'll be, we'll be looking at cellular division, especially meiotic cell division, mitotic cell division, and how organisms, and he just threw all these, uh, these uh, you know, bio, biology terms out there. And she figured, I'm heading to a political science class. Anyway, that's why you get entertained on my channel. Because, to be honest with you, I know you don't want to watch just wallpaper. So I got to come up with things to entertain you. So I'll see you on the next frame as I begin to hang this panel one, panel two. So you know, on my channel, I always discussed murals and their overlap. 100% of the time, and I do mean 100% of the time, your mural is in overlap, okay? Which means that you overlap it and you cut through the bleed. But guess what? Without any forewarning from the directions, this is the first mural that is not an overlap. Now I'm very surprised because it's thin vinyl. 
and thin vinyl is susceptible to wrinkles on the edges, okay? And that's why you get rid of the edge. You make a factory-like edge with your knife on the job site so that you have a beautiful meetup. Now, while well, that doesn't look like a, a bad seam, if the edges were compromised by wrinkles, like right here, you would want an overlap so that you could make your own edge. Instead of having the edge here, when you install it, it's here. But that's not the case. So always be aware, if you're a first timer, determine whether or not you have an overlap or a butt-to-butt -butt joint. So when you're dealing with a mural or any wallpaper, but wallpaper that's over 42 inches wide, while you set one side, the, if, if you want to keep the other side from getting knocked out of joint, so to speak, as you move this down, you have to do the same thing over here. In other words, and if Dan Childs, if you're listening, I was just thinking of you. Um, you had said, hey, Spencer, don't you think all you, can, all you have to do is just do this? And I'm pretty sure I know that's, this is what you meant. See, when you get these, this pattern joined, you don't want to be pulling this down. So if you have buckles here, like buckles like that, instead of making your wallpaper crooked to get these out, you just want to send them up and down so you, you're not knocking this this way or that way, or that way. Because then we'll have wrinkles going that way and the next pattern, the next side will not match up that well. So you just wanna do this up and down to keep this sheet level. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. See, because as you move this over, it affects over here. And so, if you want to keep the pattern level, especially if you have a noticeably level pattern, this is not. You just want to go straight like that, initially. And then, you can do diagonal sweeps to get the air pockets out. This is not an easy vinyl to work with. It's very thin, number one. It's over texture, number two, and it's not a double cut. So I have to make these meet up, despite the fact that, look at how thin this is, look at this. It's super thin material. Okay, this is from Walmer. Okay. So far, so good. So what I'm allowing the wall covering to do behind me is to relax. I just put it up, no tools, no smoother, just my hands. And what I'm hoping is that the mural will wrap itself around the texture, the nooks and crannies, so that when I lay the seams down, when I lock them down, they don't separate. That's the goal. Because I just installed three walls yesterday over texture. And guess what happened? I told the customer on the last one, it's a little flimsy. Even though it's high quality wallpaper, it's a little flimsy. Thin wall covering tends to move at the end. It's not substantial. So at the end, when it dries, it shrinks and it pulls away at the seam. So I have to color the seams. It's terrible. Ideally, you don't want wall covering over texture. Ideally. Unless, here's what you should do if you're ordering wall covering. Get a sample of the wallpaper. Spend the eight bucks to get it. Get two pieces. Put the paste on. Put it on your texture. And then join the seams. And work it out as best you can, as you see on my videos. Let it dry, come back the next day. That's how it's going to look 
when you have me install it or somebody else, if you seem separate, you either want to make your walls flat or get a different material and test them out. Spend the $30 to see what material works best on your wall. Now we just have to clean it up. So what do you think of the mural? It's a, it's a thin vinyl skin on top of a paper backing. It's kind of a unique composite. Of course, ideally, you hang this on a flat wall. And it wasn't inexpensive. This mural cost about 800 plus dollars, US dollars. Not cheap. So I'm here to tell you, you can hang a mural in a suit. Even in boots. So, what do you think? I think it's beautiful. You tell me what you think. Thanks for letting me take pictures. Oh, no problem. Thanks for letting me take pictures. Oh, no problem. Well, I'm done. So it was a pretty quick installation and uh, I'm heading back. This is Wesley Chapel, Florida. And this is my truck that I decided not to sell. Dealer wanted to give me chump change for it. So I was gonna trade it in for 250. Last minute I said, no way, buddy. He goes, you had my guy work on this for nothing. I said, I changed my mind. All right, see you on the next video.